know, Ma, <laughs> this reminds me of the time the heat went out in our old apartment back in Brooklyn. I was about, oh, seven years old, because I was still sleeping with my rag doll, Mrs. Doolittle. I remember I woke up in the middle of the night with my teeth chattering. I got out of bed, tiptoed to your bedroom door. I opened it a crack and I whispered, Mommy, Mrs. Doolittle is cold. <laughs> Mommy, Mrs. Doolittle. Yes, Ma. Cut that crap. I'm not in the mood. <laughs> oh, girls, girls, could I please share your electric blanket? No. no. Oh, come on. I can't sleep. My bed's never been so cold. Especially on a Saturday night. <laughs> oh, all right. Oh. Get in. Oh. <sighs> Listen, did you hear that sound? Yeah, and as long as I'm in my own bed, I'll do what I want. <laughs> I mean, it sounded like the heat kicking on. Thank God, get back to your own beds. Hey, everybody. Well, what are you doing? Oh, I've been tinkering with the heater, trying to get it to work. Oh, Rose, you're a genius. Boy, that's a sentence you don't hear every day. <laughs> She's working great now, except for one little thing. I turned the air conditioner on instead of the heater, and oh. now it won't go off. Now it's going to be colder inside than it is outside. I think you're right. There's an icicle forming on the nose of my bunny slippers. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Ow. There, oh. that's not so bad. Get your bunny nose out of my butt. Let's just get some sleep. Oh. Good night, Ma. Good night, Mo. Good night, Larry. I'm not going to be able to sleep. I'm on the wrong side of the bed. Well, I usually sleep on the right side, and I want to be on the right side. What the hell is everyone so particular about? In Sicily, four in a bed is a treat. <laughs> it means half your family is on vacation. <laughs> I slept with my two brothers until I was 17. I was engaged to one for a very short period of time. But that's a separate story. I wouldn't mind hearing it. Rose, shut up. Now, everybody, stay where you are and go to sleep. I have to go to work early in the morning. Oh, darn, I forgot something. Go in your pajamas. <laughs> no, it's not that. I forgot to say my prayers. Oh, Rose, God wouldn't mind if you skipped a night. He's very busy these days. Most of his free time is spent talking to Pat Robertson. <laughs> Hello, God, it's me, Rose Nyland. I'm sorry to be getting in touch so late tonight. I hope I didn't wake you. Oh, God. One at a time, Blanche. <laughs> anyway, I, I just wanted to say I think you're still doing a terrific job. Of course, there are some things I don't understand, like poverty. And the spokesmodel category on Star Search. <laughs> but then again, you work your wonders in mysterious ways. A couple of years ago, on a night like this, I would have frozen to death because I was by myself. Now I have Dorothy and Blanche and Sophia to keep me warm. Not just on a cold winter's night, but all year long. Take care of them, God. If anything happened, I just... Rose, thanks for the lovely prayer. <laughs> now shut up and get into bed. Amen. Nice work, Arthur. Wasn't me. Sweet Jesus, am I in trouble? <laughs>